I trust you, Lord. I trust you, Lord. Those of you that have your Bibles, turn with me to Hosea chapter 4. <clears throat> Hosea chapter 4. <clears throat> We're going to begin our reading at verse number one. Amen. Are we there? Amen. 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 I'm reading from the NIV, NIV version. Hear the word of the Lord, you Israelites. All right. Because the Lord has a charge. bring against you who live in the land mm -hmm. there is no faithfulness mm -hmm. no love All right. no acknowledgement of God in the land All right. there is only cursing mm -hmm. lying mm -hmm. and murder mm -hmm. stealing adultery mm -hmm. they break all bounds all right. and the bloodshed follows bloodshed all right. All right. because of this the land mourns and all who live in it waste away mm -hmm. the beasts of the field and the birds of the air and the fish of the sea are dying. All right. But let no man bring a charge. Let no man accuse another. Mm -hmm. For your people are like those who bring charges against a priest. All right. You stumble day and night. And the prophets stumble with you. All right. So I will destroy your mother. My people are destroyed from lack of knowledge. From lack of knowledge. All right, right. Because you have rejected knowledge, uh -huh. I also reject you as my priest. Uh -huh. Because you have ignored the law of your God. All right. I also will ignore your children. All right. mm -hmm. The more the priests increase, the more they sin against, against me. All right. All right. They exchange their glory for something disgraceful. Mm -hmm. They feed on the sins of my people All right. mm -hmm. and relish their wickedness. And it will be like people like priests. All right. I will punish both of them for their way. All right. And repay them for their, their deeds. deeds. All right. I, I want to stop right there. And if you look back at verse number six says, my people are destroyed from lack of knowledge. That's what I want to talk about today. I want to talk about being destroyed for the lack of knowledge. For the lack of knowledge. All right. Amen. 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 Being destroyed for the lack of knowledge. All Lord, right. please help me now as I preach your word. Ursus, you may be seated. Thank you for your service. There's a lot I want to try to get out of this message in your hearing this morning. There's a lot of information I may not can get it all the way out to you, but I'm going to do my best. And if it 
rolls over to a two part or three part, then it, that that's what it'll be. Because there's so much in this in this scripture that we need to know. All right. And although the addresser, which is God, is addressing the addressee, which is the children of Israel, mm -hmm. we, in modern day 2019, we are uh, closely resembling the children of Israel. All right. For we are living in a day and in a time where all of these things that have come up before God as a charge against the people of God, mm -hmm. we are seeing it in our time now. All right. Because it talks about that the world is full of adultery, the world is full of murder, mm -hmm. and the world is full of just sin. And uh, to add insult to injury, that there are a lot of the priests of the pastors or the preachers who are condoning yeah. a lot of the sinful nature. We're not preaching about it. We're not standing up against it. So when we don't stand up against it, people think it's all right to do it. All right. Amen. If there's never a message to correct people, people will feel as though they got a green light Amen. to continue Amen. in the way that they're doing. Amen. I'm going to say it again. Amen. If nobody ever says that you are wrong for a certain thing, we will automatically think that it's okay to do it because no one opposes me right. in the wrong that I'm doing. All right. And folk that, know, folk that are doing things wrong, they know that it is wrong and they are, they are tried out with people to see what type of reaction that they're going to get. All right. And if nobody ever says, hey man, you, that's not right, you don't need to do that. That, then, then if they don't ever say it, then they'll think the next time, okay, it must be all right then. Ain't nobody uh -huh, saying nothing right. about it. Cool. Let's just move on, proceed on a little bit further. All right. Yeah, and yeah. before you know it, they have gotten fully indoctrinated in sin. All right. Say that. Hey, amen. Amen. Like amen. amen. But, the, but the, the children of Israel uh, had been practicing sin since the inception of the people. All right. Amen. God created a people yeah. who, uh, who, who were instrumental and in, uh, 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 showing God every day of their lives mm -hmm. that they didn't want anything to do with God. All right. You know it's got to be it's got to be uh, it's got to be hurting for a God to create uh, a creature. All right. Because do you know you do know that God is the creator of all creation. All right, all right. Uh, so He creates a He created a cre a creature, a people uh, who who showed Him day after day that they did not want to have anything to do with the Creator. All right. And you know it's a sad commentary to create a people. Uh, and give people intellect, give them insight, give them knowledge, uh, the ability to be able to speak and to see and to experience life. And that creation does not at any time uh, use its voice or use its hands or use its ability or, or, or intellectual or its education to uh, en enlighten any other species Amen. about the goodness of God. All right. But... God can create a dumb brute, which is an animal who cannot talk, who can't speak, who can't wave his hand, cannot give praise to God like you and I can, but they reverence God and they give God praise every chance they get. I don't right, know how you right. feel about it, but when I go into the, because I'm a country boy, and we used to have all of the horses and the cows and the pigs and the chickens and the goat and all of that, and I believe I didn't, didn't know it then, but I recognize the fact of it now that when the cows get up in the morning and you hear them mooing in the morning, they were giving God some praise. Right. When you heard the birds Tripping in the trees, they were y'all ain't helping me. Yeah. They were giving God some yeah. praise. When I heard the ghost bad in the 
backyard, I knew that they were giving God some praise. Yeah. And God has a people that yet and still, we're sitting in here this morning, and some of you haven't given God praise yet for waking you up this All morning. Right. Allowing you to put clothes on your back, shoes on your feet, yeah. put food on your table, get gas in the car to get here this morning. You're feeling all right. You don't have a head of y'all ain't ever did here. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't get up this morning to put your hat on your feet yeah. and your shoes on your neck. You got up and put you in your right mind. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Y'all ain't ever been here. Amen. You were clothed <laughs> and in your right mind. Right right. Yeah. Say that. Hosea, I'm gonna preach today. All right. <laughs> Hosea tells us in this fourth chapter mm -hmm. of Hosea. This chapter begins a section dealing with the great detail with Israel's sin. All right. The root of which was a lack of knowledge of God and the scriptures. All right. So, so to make a crime and violence had reached a critical point. Yeah. Fear and misery prevailed in the land. All right. That was an increase of crime and violence and and always follows when a nation does not acknowledge God mm -hmm. and his word as its ultimate authority. All right. Think about our country and the state mm -hmm. in which we are in now. Yeah. We have Donald Trump yes, for president. All right. That's a whole other message by itself. <laughs> All right. But Instead, Brother Fontenot, instead of making America great again, mm. he is in turn making America hate again. That's right. Amen, life Amen. Amen. And, and I can't blame everything on Donald Trump because he, it, the, the world was messed up before he got there. It was. Amen. But when you have a a dictator, I mean a leader, uh, uh -huh. a president, or whatever you want to call it. When you have someone in place who does not acknowledge God. Yeah, all right. Because, see, the, the body does what the head does. That's all right. right. Amen. Amen. And the only reason why we as the body of Christ, the children of God, is not acting like the world is acting is because uh, our leadership is we're not under the leadership of the governing system and the governing world. All right. Amen. Amen That's right. We, we have a different leader. We're, we're marching to the beat of a different drum. We, All right. we have God as our supreme leader. Yes. And, and no matter what the world and how they turn, that's right. And they and they and they maneuver. Uh, uh, we are not affected by the world and the world's system. Amen. All right. All right. The children of Israel had had become so corrupt hmm. to the place that it was brought up to God and. God took close attention yeah. until he realized that they had grown to be so ratchet mm -hmm. All right. until he had to speak to Hosea All right. All right. concerning the people that he was leading. All right. yeah. Hosea, the, the, the Israelites' sins have come up before God and God brought a charge against the people for the way that they were living and that what that says to us is that God is expecting us as his children to live according to his way Amen. Amen. not the ways of the world that's right 
Yeah. Because see, again, if everybody, I think I said this a couple of Sundays ago, if everybody is doing mm -hmm. a certain thing, chances are it is the wrong thing to be doing. All right. Amen. 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 Because, because see, the, the, the road that leads to righteousness, uh, there's a traveler every now and then, but the road that leads uh, to, to destruction, there's a whole bunch of people on that road. All right. And if everybody is doing it, and just because uh, everybody is doing it don't necessarily mean you're supposed to be doing it. That's right. Amen. Because you're different. You're chosen. You're the royal priesthood. Amen. And, and God is expecting his children and his people to not only live according to his ways, but then he said the scripture said we need to walk uh, uh, circumspectly. We, we, are, we are a city that is set on a hill yeah. that cannot yeah. be hidden. We are chosen of God. And since we are chosen of God, we are representatives of who he is and how we are to live our lives. And God don't live his life any kind of way. Right. God don't just do any right, and everything right. say, any and everything hang with any and everybody yeah. and, and, and a part of everything that's going on in the world. That's right. Amen. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the system Yeah. Is doing anything. All right. right. The writer says that because the Lord has char has a charge to bring against you who live in the land, he says there is no faithfulness. And nobody, nobody is faithful to God anymore. All right, all right. All right. And, and that word faithful simply means that you're not committed. That's right. Uh -huh. You're not dedicated. Yeah. You're not a one God person. All right. And I'm going to put it to you like that. Hmm. Because right. when you're in a committed and a dedicated relationship right. in, the, in the physical, All right. All right. that means you're only with one somebody. All right. Amen. All right. Amen. Lights and walls. Amen. Amen. And, and, and that means you ain't you ain't with uh with your with your husband or your wife uh today, but tomorrow you you keeping time with somebody else. Amen. Right. You you're faithful to them and to them only. Amen. Say that. God is saying that that the world is not faithful to him any longer. All right. The world is not faithful to God any longer. We 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 have gotten to a place where where we we we, we with God we ride with God on Sunday. Yeah. All right. All right. Speak, Bishop. Uh, but tomorrow, <laughs> yeah, All right. yeah, yeah, we we back to business as usual. Amen. With old Slewfoot. That's it. Amen. 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 We back with the devil. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all ain't helping me. All right. right. And, and some of us don't even wait till tomorrow. It's, yes. it's later on this evening. Yes, amen. When, 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 when you're out of the view of God's people. Amen. Say that, say that. Say that. And you're out of the view of your preacher. And sometimes right. that means soon as you get in your car. All right. All right. <laughs> amen. amen. You're back to cussing. Yeah. And back to fussing. Yeah. And back to plotting and doing yeah. devilish stuff. Amen. All right. All right. Amen. Like Amen. Amen. And them same lips that you you been devilish with on Sunday night, All you right. were just giving God praise a, a couple of hours ago. With. All right. Y'all right. ain't me now. I'm Amen. Right. But the writer says that, that that there is no faithfulness and there is no love. We're living in a time now in 2019 where love is almost a thing of the past. That's right. right. Nobody love. We can say we love yeah. uh, everything, and most folk they use that we use in the term a little bit too loosely. Yeah. yeah. Say that. Say that. Yes, we are. Amen. Amen. Because we love everything but each other. Amen. Right. Yeah. I'm gonna explain that in That's just a moment. Right. Amen. I was looking on the news mm -hmm. yesterday. Yesterday evening, you probably saw it too. Uh, 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 just a couple of days ago, they had uh, within this last month, they uh, the animal shelter they had taken in mm -hmm. uh, over two hundred and something dollars. Amen. Uh -huh. And so they had a low cost adoption fee on yesterday, I believe it was, and 
they adopted uh, over 400 and something dogs out. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and they had a uh, segment on last evening where they found in a, uh, in a luggage bag, someone had dumped some puppies in a luggage bag and the people had found these puppies in this luggage. Did y'all see that? All right. And, 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 and they said on the news that they are looking for the people who dumped the puppies All in right. the luggage container and left them, in essence, left them for dead. All right. Uh, people care more about dogs. Yeah. All right. Dead. Uh, yeah. And they they are they are ready to put you behind bars almost yep. for the rest of your life for being cruel to an animal, but they will kill a black man in the street yeah. and give the officer yeah. a high five. Yeah. All right. That's right. For doing it. Yeah. Say that. Y'all, y'all. Amen. I'm not trying to sound Al Sharpton this morning. All but, right. <laughs> but we got to understand yeah. that people care more for and love everything, but don't love God and don't yeah. love human life. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It's not to me. It is it's not just black lives matter. It's all lives matter. Right. All yeah. lives matter. Yeah. God created us all equally. Amen. Amen. And we got to get to a place in God where we bring back the love towards one another. Amen. That's right. Amen. I did say, I did say that, that, uh, uh, that we love everything uh -huh. uh, but God and each other. That's uh, right. Uh, there are too many, and we use the term love loose, so loosely uh -huh. until we I see women and men alike that love everything but each other. Amen. Uh, 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 a woman can see a color. Oh, oh, I just love that red. Yeah. Oh, I just love that dress. Oh, girl, I just love your hair. All right. Me and I just love your smell. That's a nice suit. I love it. Uh, that's my favorite color. I just love the color of it. Oh, can't you imagine <laughs> if we could display and show that love towards one, one another, another that yeah. to objects or inanimate? Yeah. And objects this world could change yeah. and turn into something that God, y'all ain't helping me right. here, that God would be pleased with. Amen. Right. That's right. What well, the writer says in 2 Chronicles 7 14, if my people which were called, called by, by my name, name yeah. would humble, humble themselves, themselves and pray and, and seek his, his face. face, he says, then, y'all, y'all ain't right. helping me here. Right. He says, then I would hear from heaven, forgive them of their sins, and heal the land. The land. All right. But he says, Hosea says, they are, hmm. there's no faithfulness, there's no love, mm -hmm. and then there is no acknowledgement of God in the land. They, it has gotten so critical, and I want y'all to really listen to this. It has gotten so critical now that they are not wanting to mention God in anything. That's All right. right. I told y'all a couple of Sundays ago. I had I, I listen and I and I look at the news. I don't got to be my old person now because <laughs> see, I used to wonder why the old people would listen to the news yeah. and they would look at see in our day, in my day, uh, 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 not only would we listen to the news, but they had the newspaper. You could read That's the news. Right. Right. And right. you can keep up with everything. Now, I, I haven't seen a newspaper in a long time. <laughs> and so I keep up with Facebook and, and, and other means and, uh, of, uh, of keeping up with society. And, and I notice something now that there's things going on and they only give it a little bit of press. Yeah. But I heard them talking about in the, in the Senate uh, that normally they would swear you in. And after they swear you in, they would say, and so help me God. But now they have taken the so help me God. God out of the swear statement right. because they don't want to make have no mention of no God. God in anything. Yeah, all right. All right. And, and when God is taken out of the equation, yeah. we are in trouble. trouble. That's right. All right. I'm, here to, I'm here to help y'all to understand where we are. And this is the same thing that was going on then is going on now. Right. But nobody wants to acknowledge God. I said it. 
Once I've said it twice, we can talk about any and every uh, type of, uh, 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 of issue or subject material, yeah. subject matter, but we can't talk about God. We can talk about gays, yeah. we can talk about lesbians, we can talk about the job, we can talk about finances, we can talk about uh, whatever's going on in society. Yeah. But st folks start cringing up, yeah. and when you start talking about God, do me a favor for those of you who work. Uh, you can talk about sports, but when you start talking about God, notice what the people, how they face is going to turn when you get to talking about God. Hey. Notice, notice how quiet they're going to get hey. when you get to mentioning the name yeah. of God. Notice! All right. All right. Amen. Amen. Folks don't want to talk about God. That's they don't right. want to acknowledge the fact hey. that God is real. Amen. Amen. I'm here to tell you, and I know folk have, have decided that God is not real, but just wake up in the morning. That's right. On the yeah. other side of your tomorrow. Yeah. And you're going to recognize the fact that God is real. Amen. More yeah. importantly, you're going to recognize the fact that hell is yeah. true. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Say that. Say that. Yeah. Amen. Amen. And because there's only cursing and lying and murder, uh -huh. stealing and adultery. Mm -hmm. And, and he wasn't, that word adultery wasn't just talking primarily uh, about an extramarital effect. All right. But that adultery goes back to the first word and when he says that there is no faithfulness. Yeah. Uh -huh. See, if you are in a committed relationship with God yeah. and you start fraternizing with others, See, see, I can't get in trouble, Sister Molly. I'm talking about myself. That's right. I can't get, I can't get in trouble, Brother Fontenot. Amen. By, by, by telling it on myself. Amen. All right. Says because, because there's only cursing, lying, murder, stealing, and adultery. Uh -huh. They break all. Bounds. All right. And the bloodshed follows more bloodshed. All yeah. right. We're looking at a time now where there's bloodshed all over the place. That's right. There's no place sacred or safe. Now. Amen. Uh -huh. They're going into the schools and killing up our daughters and our sons. Amen. Right. They're going into the church, churches and the synagogues, and killing up the parishioners. Amen. All right. No place is sacred or safe anymore. Amen. All right. Death and bloodshed only begets more death and bloodshed. And bloodshed. All right. And I wonder now, it used to be that certain crimes was classified to certain types of people. Right. All right. But now that the enemy is running so rampant, until now, you don't know who doing the crime. That's right. Amen. Amen. Because when you used to hear about people taking babies and microwaving them in the microwave oven or sticking them in the oven and burning them up and killing them, uh -huh. you automatically was associating that type of behavior, that type of crime with a certain
class of people. All right. That's right. But now that stuff has trickled over even until our race. That's right. Y'all ain't helping me now. Uh, uh, because there's no way in the world that we should be uh, still looking for a four-year-old by the name of Malia. All right. Malia. 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 Uh, All right. Because of the heinousness of uh, uh, the perpetrator by which the devil used to cause her little bitty body to be now wherever it is. Amen. All right. Set. Amen. And to dismember. Hmm. And then have the audacity to not want to be forthcoming hmm. All right. with the information of right. her whereabouts. That's All right. At least give the family, at least give us who's rooting for her to still be alive uh, the closure right. to know that we can lay her to way properly. Amen. Yes. Amen. 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 Folk, yes. folk, now, folk now don't care. That's right. And uh, there is no love. Amen. 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 That's a whole nother subject and sermon for a whole nother day. Amen. Amen. I didn't come to preach about her. Amen. Because I get stirred up because I've been following that situation. Amen. And I get really disturbed mm. in my spirit about it. Amen. 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 But I will say this publicly that that is a beautiful child of God. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. That didn't deserve whatever. That's right. Say that has happened to her. Amen. But wherever she is, God knows. Amen. And God knows what happened to her. Amen. Verse 3 says, But this, of this the man mourns, and who lives in waste away. Amen. The beast of the field and the birds of the air and the fish of the sea are dying. But let no man bring a charge. Let no man accuse another. All right. For your people are like those who bring charges against the priests. Mm -hmm. You stumble day and night, and the prophets stumble with you. Mm -hmm. Hosea is saying to the people of God that all of these calamities and things that are happening, God will put us in a in a special predicament. Yeah. He'll bring famine and place it in the land. Amen. All right. Yes, he will. Amen. God will put us in a, because of our sin, God will put us in, in, in our uh, inability to acknowledge him for who he is and to uh, 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 and try to learn of him. Right. He will put us in a position where we have to turn to him after it's all said and done. Amen. All right. All right. Don't let nobody, don't let no man bring a charge against one another. You can't blame, I can't blame you, and you right. can't blame me. It, it's all of us together. We all, right. we all collectively cause this charge to come against us all. all right. Because we all were messing up. We all were living life like we wanted to. We all were living life like it's golden. Y'all ain't helping me yeah. now. Right. And, and because we've been living it like it's golden, God gonna make sure if we don't stop living like it's golden, he gonna make sure we're molten. All right. All right. All right. All right. Molten is, is melted. That's what hot lock. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 Because of us, we not just we not only stumbling in the nighttime, but we stumbling in the day. We, yeah, that's right. right. Because God has a way of causing us not to be able to walk straight. That's All right. right. To walk upright. That's right. Amen. 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 Because if you're not walking up in Him, you're not walking upright anyway. Amen. Amen. All right. Verse six says. My people are destroyed. That word knowledge, let me help you, is a familiarity or awareness mm -hmm. or understanding of someone or something as facts. All right, all right. Or factual information, descriptions, or skills 
which is acquired through experience or education by perceiving, discovering, or learning. All right. So in other words, he's saying that, that, that my people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge. They are being destroyed simply because they don't know who he is. Amen. All right. That's all God is saying. That, 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 that you, you as a people, it is your job to get to know the Lord. Now, That's I, I right. pulled over some years ago by the police. <laughs> and um, the police told me uh, something that it sticks with me to this day. All right. I forgot what the citation was, and I forgot what he said to me, but he told me this, that, and the other. And I said to him, oh, I said, sir, I did not know that. Mm -hmm. That was my response. Mm -hmm. His reply to me was, your ignorance of the law is not a proper defense. All right. That stuck with me. And, and Deacon Wilson knows because he probably said that because being in law enforcement, he knows that, that my ignorance of the law is not a proper defense. So I had to, not because I wasn't educated on the law, that's simply saying that you can't get out of this because you didn't know. All right. All right. That's right. It's still a law. That's right. And he's here to enforce the law. All right. Amen. Amen. Lice and walk. All right. And so what God is simply saying that you're being destroyed because you don't know me. All right. Amen. It is your job to know who I am. All right. All right. Amen. I, I, I am the creator yeah. of all mankind. All right. I, 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 I created the stars and the moon and and I put the clouds in the sky and I, yeah. I put the birds in the air. Y'all ain't helping right. me now. Yeah. I, I'm the one who put water in the dry places. I, yeah. I, I, I cry, y'all ain't helping me. I, yeah. I cause the tender plants to be rooted up out of dry ground. I'm the yeah. one. Yes. Yeah. Amen. And it's your job to take the yoke, the Bible says. Jesus says, take my yoke upon, upon you and learn of me. All right. For my yoke is easy yeah. and uh, yeah, Bird is my alive. burdens. Yeah. I, I, I got a few Bible readers this yeah. morning. My burdens are light. And, right. and, and, and as recorded over in Romans chapter 10, uh -huh. of around verse 1 through 3, right. uh, Paul says to the church at Rome about the Israelites because Jesus says, he said they're destroyed for the lack of knowledge. knowledge. And right. check out what Romans chapter 10 verse 1 says, Brethren, uh, my uh, heart's desire and prayer to God yeah. for Israel is yeah. that they yeah. might be saved. For I can testify about them that they are zealous for God, but their zeal is not based on knowledge. Y'all ain't with me. There are too many people in the, in the body of Christ who sit here Sunday after Sunday and we're no more better or growing. We're not growing anymore spiritually because all we think that our zeal is all we need. But you got to have a personal relationship yeah. with God. You not only got to pray yeah. on Sunday, you got to pray on Monday, you yeah. got to pray on Tuesday, you got to read your word yeah. and spend time with God because yeah. God needs to be in you yeah. just as much as you need to be in you. Amen. Alright. The writer says, if you abide in Jesus said, if you abide in me, I will abide I in you. I will abide in yeah. you. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, yeah. Amen. Like Amen. So he says, he says that they have a zeal of God, but mm -hmm. but are not according to knowledge. knowledge. All right. And since they did not know the righteousness that comes from God, and they sought to establish their own. So that's what happened to the Israelites. They did not take out the time to try to get to know God like they should have. So in essence, what they did was, well, that's too much. That's too heavy for us to try to understand and comprehend. Right. So we're going to establish our own way right. of how we ought to do things. Yeah. And anytime you go away from God, yeah. you've gotten away from the whole plan of All God. Right. And then you're subject to be cut down and trotted under the feet of me. Y'all yeah. ain't helping me now. Well, my brothers and my sisters, we, we need to understand here yeah. that Hosea is saying that they 
are destroyed for the lack of knowledge. All right. B part of six says, because you have rejected knowledge. Yeah. I also reject you as my priest. Now, now this is not only a a, a, a word of uh, admonishment, uh -huh. but this is a word of punishment. All right. Uh, because he says in the B part, he says, because you have rejected knowledge, I also reject you as my priest. You no longer my priest. All, All right. right. You're fired. Yeah. All right. Mm. And not only are you fired, but I'm going to cause the same thing uh, that's going to happen to the people that you were leading. I'm going. You're going to be also affected by the same punishment right. because you, as my priest, allowed them to live this life yeah. that is not according to me. All right. Yeah. Amen. 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 Let that be a let that be a sir a, a public service announcement to every preacher pastor. We can't allow the people yeah. that we're leading to live any kind of life yeah. that you condone it by not preaching the truth to yeah. your people. All right. That's yeah. right. If you say you love them, preach the truth to them. Amen. 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 Quit just pacifying them to have a member and a dollar. Yeah. All right. Amen. 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 Yeah. I don't care if it get down to one person. I'm going to keep on preaching. Amen. I'm going to keep telling the truth. That's right. Amen. They can run on over to the big congregations and the big churches, right. and they can all go to hell together. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Like Amen. Because guess what? In the first time before the floods came, and after the floods, it wasn't but eight people that got saved. Amen. That's right. People on the earth. Yes. But eight people got saved. That's right. Yes. Noah and his family. Amen. Y'all ain't helping me now. Amen. Huh? And if it get down to just me and one other or just me by myself, I'm going to step on board. All right. Yeah. yeah. Amen. Amen. And I'm not going to be concerned who don't make it. That's Amen. right. Because you got the same choice as I do. That's yeah. right. Say that. Say that. Amen, Lysie. Amen. Amen. Some of us don't want to come in until it's, it's entirely too late. That's Amen. right. All right. Amen. Amen. They had time to get there because Noah was building on the ark for a long time. He didn't build it over the weekend. That's All right. right. Say that. Say that. The said that he was telling them that every day it's going to rain. That's right. All right. We ain't had rain in 400 years, man. You out here, you must be out your mind yeah. talking about it's going to rain. Yeah. Look at it. He crazy as all out. Get out. Yeah. Over there building a boat, we haven't seen water since the last time we seen water. All right. All right. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah. Folks, yeah. sometimes. They can see you, and, and they can see. They know God is speaking to you, but then they, they ignore you because he must be out of his mind. God, if God told him to do that, or God told him to do that. Man, I don't know why he's doing that because that just don't seem like God would do such a thing. Yeah. Who are you to try to understand the mind of God? All right. Amen. Say that. Say that. Say that. Amen. Oh. Wow. But then when the rain started. <laughs> uh huh. Get in a hurry. I wasn't there. Hmm. It was mildly, but I could just imagine. Mm -hmm. Use my spiritual imagination. And after Job had finished the yeah. ark, yeah. then the Lord sent the thunder, because you know the thunder had to come first. All right. right. Yeah. And he sent the lightning. Uh -huh. Folk was still all right as long as the thunder. And the lightning was flashing. Can you imagine sitting there talking mm. to your friends? Noah been preaching, talking about it's gonna rain. All right. Uh -huh. But we ain't seen no rain. Uh -huh. All, right. mm -hmm. All of a sudden, the thunder and the lightning begin to flash. All right. 
the rain starts and the first drip hits him on the shoulder. Mm -hmm. I can imagine if it had been me standing there and a drip hit me on the shoulder, on the forehead, I'd have been like, Then more, more proceeds to fall out of the sky. All right. Thinking to myself now, well, the clouds don't look too heavy. This ain't going to be much. Mm -hmm. You know how we do. Mm -hmm. We try to size up how big the storm going to be by looking at the clouds. All right. <laughs> hey, this ain't going to be much the sun shining. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Every five minutes it'll be over. Yeah. You know how we do here in Houston. Amen. Sometimes God can dump a whole lot of water. <laughs> say that. Say that. Minutes. Out of a little bit of little bit of cloud and a short length of time. That's All right. right. All right. There they were. The rain starts. Yeah. Everybody was cool. All right. Uh -huh. Until they realized that the ground was getting wet. All right. All right. The water started to rise. Mm. Looked mm. around there. Mm -mm. They was the water was in between their toes. All right. Y'all stay with me. Oh yeah, right. we with you. <laughs> Kept on raining. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sister Margaret looked around now, and it was around the ankles. All right. Yeah. Noah was putting the finishing touches on the ark. All right. Getting ready to put the door, the front door in. All right. Look around there. Water was up around the knees. Yeah. Right. yeah. Mm -hmm. Some folk, oh, it ain't going to be that bad. It's a bad mm -hmm. Still drinking, partying, and having a good time. All right. Mm -hmm. Some were at the juke joint. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Some were at the boyfriend's house. All right. All right. <laughs> Some were at the gambling hall. Yeah. All right. Amen. Amen. I gotta be martyr now. Some were at the club. That's right. it. <laughs> Some were at the at the convenience store behind the back wall on the little game machine. Oh, all right, all right. All right. That's it. All right. <laughs> Some were at the boat. That's uh -huh. it. The one that don't float. All right. <laughs> all right. And. Looked around, it was waist deep now. All right. All right. Well, we can still handle this. Yeah. But by that time, they waist deep, the boat started to float. All right. The Bible says that the water kept on rising. Yeah. And. Look around there, it was chesty. Yeah. All right. Now panic is starting to set in. All right. Mm -hmm. To the point where Job said, well, it's time to shut this thing. Let me close the doors. We didn't got all the animals in like he told me. We followed his last instructions to the letter. Time to shut the door. And whatever God directs us to do next, that's what we're going to do. All right. All right. Here they come now. Mm -hmm. I know that. People are leaving the taverns and leaving their homes and leaving out of the fields and coming. And the, the, the writer says that they swam out to the boat. All right. To the ark. Yeah. <coughs> Knocked on the door. Mm. Brother Noah, can you let us in? Mm. All right. Brother Noah, we, we, we know you hear us in there. Can you let us in? All right. Noah says, simply says, hmm. 
No, I cannot. All right. All right. For we have sealed the doors. God has the key. All right. And you can't get in. All right. Oh, bless the name of the Lord. Yes. I don't know how y'all feel about it, but there, are, there are, have been too many warnings that have been given to us. Yes. And why does God have to punish us? Why do we have to end up in situations where it will prove to be our demise when we could just hear the words and the warnings of God? That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All you got to do is acknowledge him. That's right. Amen. 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 And then you must take his word and you must study his word as Timothy says, study to show thyself approved unto God, a workman that needed not be ashamed, yeah, rightly right dividing the word of truth. truth. Right. It is your job, it is your, it is for you yourself yeah. to learn of God and to become the word yeah. of God. All right. All right. It is your job. Amen. Amen, Lysa. Amen. Amen. Because you got to have a relationship. With God yeah. for yourself. Amen. But the truth of the matter is, and the saddest commentary is, is that we would we would rather have a relationship with everybody other than God. That's right. All right. We want to be friends with everybody. Uh, amen. Uh, but God. That's right. We we want to talk to everybody uh, except for God. Amen. Amen. We want to be uh, uh, in fellowship with everybody except for God. All right. Y'all yeah, yeah, yeah. ain't helping me now. Y'all I mean, feel like I'm finna walk down y'all street <laughs> and sit on your porch a while. But give yourself a high five and say, I'm coming. I'm All coming. Right. <laughs> I'm coming down your street. I'm oh, on yeah. the way. Because see, you got to understand because your fellowships and your friendships and your kinships yeah. with everybody is not necessarily the will of God because yeah. the question was asked to Jesus, <laughs> who is your brother? Who is yeah. your mother and your father? And Jesus said, my brother and my mother and my sister and my father and says, only those who, those who do the will oh, of a... my father. That's who yeah. my brother and my sister and my mother and my yeah. father. Only those yeah. right. who do the will yeah. of my <laughs> father. So you can have a brother or a sister or uncle or any family member. If they not going down the road, you going down yeah. the road. Yeah. You going down. <laughs> Chances <laughs> are, you might as well stop. You're wasting your time. Yes. All right. That's right. right. Because yeah, only yeah, yeah. 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 Who do the will? Say that. My Say father. That. Oh, my father. All yeah. right. That's why. That's why I don't waste too much time even with biological brothers. <laughs> All right. All right. Yeah. Because they ain't doing the will of my father. Yeah. And I ain't got time wasting. Yeah. around you trying to be like you. Be, because God done already gave me my prerequisite. All right. All right. He done already told me what he want me to do. Y'all yeah. right. ain't helping me All now. All right. Uh, and I learned a long time ago that I am here not because of people's grace. Yeah. But I'm here right. because of God's grace. Yeah. Because people ain't gracious to me. That's right. Hey. People would rather see me fall. That's right. right. Yeah, people don't want to support you. Y'all ain't got me. All right. But God is there. Yes. Even in the midst of troubling times. Yes. All right. God is there because he, he, again, he is no short of his word. He cannot lie. God said that I will never leave you. Nor right. forsake you. Nor will I forsake you. All right. Yeah. Oh, my brothers and my sisters, a couple more things I need to tell you. There are three types of knowledge. All right. That we need to attain and that we should attain even in our youth. All right. The first is physical knowledge. All right. All right. You have been taught that knowledge is broken down into three types of three <laughs> categories. There's physical knowledge. All right. Then there is logical slash mathematical knowledge. All right. 
And then there is social knowledge. All right. Physical knowledge is also called empirical knowledge uh, that has to do with the knowledge about objects in the world. All right. All right. I don't know about you all, but I learned in my short tenure in life yeah. that God is all about awareness and awakeness. All he right. wants you to be in the know. That's right. He, he, he would not have you being ignorant uh, regarding the scriptures and who he is in your life. All right. See, the devil don't want you to know everything about you about him, but God wants you to know everything about him. At the same time, he's still a mystery to all of us. All right. But because your your thirst and your hunger after righteousness, yeah. he will disclose some things to you right. that he won't disclose to anybody else. Right. And that's why you got the what you got to understand about God. He will never let us know everything about him but as you thirst and you hunger for more knowledge of him yeah. he will release to you more about him yeah. than he would to the average person amen right. yeah. amen because all people know about god is, is that he's god mm -hmm. and that we start associating blessings and the tangible things and gifts with God, and that's a part of it. Mm -hmm. But there's more to God than say that, say just that. blessings. That's right. There's more to God than just what we associate the good stuff. That's right. Because we think that all good is that's all God is about. Mm -hmm. And God is not only about good, He also yeah. deals with the, the bad stuff that happens in our lives, yeah, also. Yeah. Amen. He, he is the creator of all. Things. Amen. Can I help y'all so y'all don't y'all don't go home messed up? He is the creator of all creation. Yeah. So, and that includes the devil. All right. Amen. Oh, Amen. Oh. Amen. See, see, and everything is subject unto God. Amen. And not only is he the creator of even the devil, because you got to be reminded that the devil is a fallen angel. Yeah. The devil is angelic also. Yeah. Amen. The devil has had an opportunity to be around the holy of holies. Yeah. He has the, has had the opportunity to be even in heaven, but he got yeah. ejected out of heaven. Y'all ain't helping me All now. Right. And so since he's down here now, he's doing everything in his, within his power to make sure that other people yeah. have the same fate as him yeah. because one thing about it, the devil can no longer be saved. Y'all yeah. ain't helping me up in here now. You can, yeah. but not the devil. Yeah. The devil already know he's going to hell. Yeah. He already know what his fate is. Yeah. And he's trying to get anybody he can to go with it. All right. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. That's right. That's why you must understand mm -hmm. that the devil does not have unlimited authority. That's All right. right. His authority at its best is limited. Yes. All right. And I know folk will tell you that the devil don't have no power. Yes, he does. I don't teach that. That's mm. a that's a that's a doctrine that ought to not be taught. All that's right. right. Yeah. Because the devil Say that. Say has that. power. Yes, he yeah. does. Amen. He has the permissive authority of That's God. Right. All right. To do whatever he asks God permission to do concerning you. Amen. All right. That within that, that's a whole lot of power. Amen. All right. Yeah. That you have God's stamp of approval for that's the devil right. to mess with you. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. And so the devil do have power. Yeah. All right. Amen. 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 But God already knows your expected end. All yeah. right. And God already knows what you are capable of. Yeah. And just what you can handle. Yeah. So God will not allow anything to come upon you more than Maybe what you can handle. Can handle. That's right. right. But if you don't know the word of God <laughs> and you don't have a relationship with God, yeah. you wouldn't know that. Yeah. Y'all right. ain't helping me in here now. Yeah. That's why you don't have to go into the bedroom and blow your brains out. All right. All right. When life is seemingly gotten hard for you. Yeah. Right? You don't have to go into the room and take a bottle of pills. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Neither 
Do you need to take a razor to your wrist? Yeah. yeah. But you must understand, people of God, that God, he loves us. Yeah. As we look over the John chapter 3. Yeah. Verse 16 says, For God so loved, so loved the world, world. Yeah. yeah. that he gave his only the begotten God. son. Yeah. 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 That whosoever believeth in him shall yeah. not perish. Yeah. yeah. But have everlasting, everlasting life. life. Yeah. 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 I don't know how you feel about it, but God, God loved us so much. Yeah. That he was willing to part with his only son. Yes. To save a sinful world. Yeah. To reconcile the world back to him. Yes. We were destined for doom and destruction. Yeah. But because God loved us so much yes. that he sent his only son to redeem us back to him. Yeah. And I've done a lot of messing up in my <laughs> days. Yeah. But I thank God that I'm on the right road now. Yeah. And the old songwriter says, since I fixed it up with, with Jesus. Jesus. Yeah. Yes, my brothers and my sisters, yeah. I fixed it up with Jesus a long time ago. Yeah. And I am glad that the Lord, he still loves me. Yeah. Some days I don't do everything that I should. Yeah. I don't say all of the right things at the right time. Yeah. Some days I I don't treat a people according to the way they should be treated. Yeah. But I haven't told anybody that I'm perfect. Yeah. As I remember what the, what the writer says in Philippians 1 and verse 6. <laughs> being confident in of this very thing. Yeah. That he that has begun a, a good work will shall perform it unto the day of the Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. I'm so glad that the Lord is still working on me. Yes. I'm not the finished product, but I'm still under construction. Yes. Is there anybody in the house that can testify yes. that I am under construction? Yes. So when you look at me and you don't see, if you don't see some things that look right, yes. don't judge me because this is not the finished product. Yes. Since the last time 
we seen our Bibles. Yeah. Some of you don't even know where it is. But I'm here to tell you, you need the word of God yeah. in 2019. Yeah. You need to spend time with God yeah. and develop a relationship with God. Yeah. And the Lord, all right. Oh, my brothers and sisters, yeah. I tried it every other way. Yeah. I tried to live in the world yeah. and do what everybody was doing. Yeah. It was all right for a little while, but I found in the Savior yeah. a sweet old resting place. Yeah. And he had yeah. made me laugh. Yeah. Oh, thank you, God. Yeah. I feel your presence now. For saving me, thank you, Jesus, yeah. for making me whole. Yes, yeah. yes, yeah. thank you, God. Yeah. Is there anybody here that's done your best yeah. when you were out there in the world? I know yeah. I did. It. I did. I wasn't shabby with the devil. Yeah. I, I was a good devil. Yeah. I did what I wanted. To, said what I wanted. Yeah. I was with who I wanted to be with. That doing all of those things, yeah. it didn't profit me anything. Yeah. But now yeah. that I'm on the Lord's side, yeah. Yeah. yes, God, yeah. I trust Him with all my heart, yeah. my body and soul. Yeah. The Lord is true to His word. Yeah. Jesus said, "When two or three are gathered, yeah. touching it, agreeing, yeah. He said, I." That's going to touch and agree with me yeah. That your ladder yeah. Shall be greater yeah. Yes. Yeah. Thank you Jesus uh -huh. Thank you Lord yeah. I know you've been struggling yeah. But you're coming out yeah. I know it's been hard on the job yeah. They don't appreciate you yeah. But you're coming out yeah. Yeah. For saving me, yeah. thank you, God, for raising me up. Yeah. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank yeah. You, Jesus. yeah. I'm so grateful today yes. that God, yes. through His faithfulness, yes. even though we now we haven't been faithful to Him, He's been faithful to us. All right. Even though we've been cheating on Him, He yeah. hasn't cheated yeah. on us. Amen. 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 He's still been committed. Yes. When you've been committed to somebody and giving your all to somebody, it's a hurtful thing for the one that you love the most. Yes. Yes. Treat you like you don't even exist. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. That's what God is saying to us. We got to stop treating him. That's right. Yes. Like he don't exist. Like he don't exist. Amen. 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 Because we only exist hmm. because of him. Because he leaves. That's right. Amen. 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 And if God wanted to, hmm. he can wipe us all out. Amen. Yes. yes. In just a moment's notice. That's right. He can speak one word and all of our breath hmm. will leave our bodies. Amen. Yes. Amen. 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 As a matter of fact, since he's in us, yeah, he can just decide to vacate the premises. Yeah. Amen. That's right. Amen. Y'all don't think he in you? <laughs> let me help you think that, that. I'm gonna let you know that that's not your breath. All right. All right. Amen. This gonna bless you real good. Because <laughs> the breath that you breathe, yeah, is not your. All right. All right. All right. I'm gonna show you. After the Lord had created man, yeah. The breath of life. Said then he breathed. <laughs> yeah. All right. The breath of life. The breath of life. That's right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. He put his breath. Amen. In us. Yeah. Right. That's yeah. right. When God get ready, He can take His breath. All right. Out of us. All right. Amen. Yeah. 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 Amen. Yeah. Say that. This ain't yours. Amen. All right. And since He put His breath in you, yeah. you ought to live for Him. All yeah. right. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Folk thinking that it's all about 
about them. <laughs> trying to denounce God. And mm -hmm. There is no God. Yeah. When you can't even have a breath to say there is no God without God. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. Amen. How arrogant and how ignorant mm. that is. All Amen. right. Say that. Say that. Amen. Amen. But we got to get to the place where we desire knowledge of God. Yeah. yeah. And the righteousness of God. Yes. Amen. Amen. Because only what you do for Christ Amen. is going to last. Amen. All right, all right. May God bless you. Amen. May Amen. God keep you. Amen. Is my prayer. Amen. I hope and pray that something has been said or Amen. done to help you along your journey. Amen. I certainly hope and pray that you have your knowledge of God has been increased, enhanced. On this day. Amen. To the point where you have developed a sense <clears throat> of uh, wanting to know more. Amen. About the word of God. Amen. Because everything you need to know, want to know, should know, is in the word of God. Amen. Right. There's nothing that we're dealing with in 2019 that hasn't already been dealt with. That's why the scripture says there's nothing new under, under the, the heavens. Sun. That's right. Under the sun. Under there's the sun. nothing new. That's right. Everything that has been dealt with and presently dealing with has already been exactly. done before. That's right. right. So, and God is a master. He's yeah. a master of all. That's right. He knows every situation. Amen. He knows every outcome in its beginning. Amen. He knows the outcome. Yeah. All we have to do is trust him yeah. at his word. Amen. Jesus said, the day that you hear my voice, harden not your heart. Would that be one on today? While the blood is running warm in your veins. Yeah. While you have this opportunity to be able to walk down the aisle for yourself. Amen. Will you come? Because time is of the essence. Amen. Time waits on no man. Amen. The time is right now. Amen. Don't allow the enemy to place it, put it in your mind that you have time. Mm -hmm. Or you can you can get to it next week, or next month, or the next time you come. All you really have is right now. Amen. But no guarantee. There's no guarantee for not one of us mm -hmm. who got out, got up, put your clothes on, came out to the place, this house of worship this morning. No guarantee that we're going to make it back the way we came. Amen. Amen. I see accidents and fatal accidents on the freeways every day. Amen. Amen. But Jesus says, pardon not your heart. Mm -hmm. Will you come? Whatever you need, God is God.
Yes, God He's got it, and He's waiting to give it to you. If you need more joy, God's got it. If you need more joy.